Hello viewers. I'm so thankful for the encouragement you giving me through liking, commenting on my paintings. Today I'm going to start sharing a series of painting for acrylic painting ideas on mini canvas just for you. So let's go to look, watch and observe. Hello viewers. I am about to start another painting for Galaxy series on acrylic painting ideas. Now using the palette knife, I am placing primary blue with ultramarine and some black at the border. Some turquoise cyan with white of course in the middle there you go so let's start dabbing oops the sponge has lots of water in it remember I told you that don't get panicked or frustrated you can fix the painting errors and the best part of it is that you learn so there you go I'm going to fix this and using the sponge or sponge brush to absorb the liquidy application easily done so back to dabbing to blend the paint on the canvas Let's blur the paint a little by sponging over the colors applied on the canvas. Actually, sponge is good to create gas clouds in galaxy painting, while toothbrush is good for the stars. The wonderful fact about painting galaxies is that more or less you can do whatever you target or whatever you select. It gives you a wide range to paint and fixing your errors is easily manageable. Keep on dabbing, blend the colors well, merge the colors well with each other. Now almost I have come to the middle. As you can see that I have layers of blues and white so far. Actually in colors, blues, pinks and purples are really good to go with for galaxies or for space. I want to have some areas heavy with dark color and then stretch out to get the gas like effect on my galaxy. Dab, dab, dab. Now, I think let's add some more color. I think I should add some more color other than blue and um, 
I think I should go for maybe some yellows on the edges it's better that it's more darker and there you go I've taken some cadmium yellow for the gassy effect and let's spread it over on few spots and here I'm using cadmium yellow with a tint of gold for the stars there you go after the application after the splatter effect just let it dry for a while and now add the fantasy to your galaxy it's a bit vague let me bring it to the light now place the stencil carefully fix it this one also needs some dabbing using your fingers place it well and I'm using chrome yellow with a bit of golden to fill in the stencil and I think I'm going to use some other color and I would like not to merge it with the cadmium yellow and gold I think copper is better so let's use some copper for the hammock and later I'll give more detail after removing the stencil Let's fill the color in the blank. And be very careful while taking off the stencil. You know, drawing it is not that difficult, but I just wanted to introduce this to you. If you use a stencil, it will be easier for you in the beginning. And there you go. And let's bring the image to light, applying some black blending with gold and chrome yellow. There's a hammock. Let's draw some, give it some outlines. There you go, a reader enjoying the hammock in Galaxy. I'm going to apply some lines using the same paints from yellow and golden with a bit of copper and black of course
for some fine details, I think. I should use something else. Let's see. Where's the reader? Oh yes, a toothpick would do better. For the fine lines, I'm using a toothpick. I hope you would like this acrylic painting idea of mine. displaying a reader in hammock traveling in galaxy so viewers bye for now from virtuoso palette as that's the ending stroke of my painting there you go so viewers I hope you liked the demonstration of my acrylic painting ideas. It was all about fantasy and this was my version for acrylic painting ideas. Do let me know if you have any questions or suggestions in the comment box and I'll be glad to answer you for your queries. Thank you so much. See you.